The Fit Electric Smart Floodlight Security Camera makes it easy to upgrade your exterior home lighting to a flexible home security system. Protect your property and always know what's going on at home from any location using your smart mobile device. Feel empowered with powerful home security in the palm of your hands. Receive push notifications when activity is detected up to 32 and 270 degrees. Capture, playback and share video and still recordings on your mobile device. Two-way talk or sound the 100 decibel siren to scare off intruders. While the powerful lights leave no dark corners to hide, always record in 1080p high definition to see faces and read license plates. Designed for simple DIY installation with no subscription fees, hub or special smart home hardware required. All you need is Wi-Fi. Make sure the LED is blinking blue. If the LED is blinking red, you will need to press and hold reset button located behind the cover on the side of the camera. Test your Wi-Fi network with other devices such as your phone or computer to make sure it is operating properly. The Wi-Fi connection may be out of range during pairing. Use your phone to check range. It is recommended to have at least two signal bars showing for proper connection. Your Wi-Fi network password is case sensitive. Make sure you are entering it correctly. The camera is offline. There could be a temporary issue with your internet connection, e.g. service disruption. Please try again in a few minutes. Make sure your Wi-Fi router is turned on. The camera may not have power to it. Make sure the wall switch and breaker is in the on position. The camera may not have power to it. Make sure the wall switch and breaker is in the on position. Cycle the power off and on. You will hear an audible tone and the status LED should blink red then to a solid blue in about one minute. If it does not turn blue after a minute, please go through the setup process again to reconnect to your Wi-Fi signal. Make sure the camera is getting a good signal from your Wi-Fi router. Use your phone to check range. It is recommended to have at least two signal bars showing for proper connection. The camera may have been disconnected from your Wi-Fi network. Press and hold reset button. See the resetting unit and accessing SD card section until you see a blinking blue LED and hear an audible tone. Limited internet bandwidth at home. For example, other video streaming services running at the same time on your network can cause congestion slowing down the internet upload and download speeds. Wi-Fi reception may not be stable or work reliably if the camera's Wi-Fi signal strength is less than two signal bars. You may need to install a Wi-Fi repeater or extender to boost the Wi-Fi signal. How to reset the camera to re-enter pairing mode? Press and hold reset button located behind the cover on the side of the camera. See the resetting unit and accessing SD card section until you see a blinking blue LED and hear an audible tone. The camera is not recording? Make sure record switch is turned on in app. Under SD card settings, this is located in the settings menu on the upper right corner in the control panel. Make sure that the micro SD card is installed correctly. To confirm the camera is recognizing the micro SD card, go to the SD card settings in the settings menu and make sure micro SD card capacity menu shows total capacity used in free space. If this does not appear, you may consider reformatting the micro SD card. Warning, reformatting micro SD card will delete all videos stored on card. Please go through the troubleshooting section before doing so or contact our customer support team. How do I set the camera to event or continuous recording? In the settings menu under SD card settings, make sure record switch is turned on and then select event recording or continuous recording. How can I check the available space on the SD card? In the settings menu under SD card settings, you will see you space and free space. No, camera will not support micro SD cards greater than 128 GB. What happens when the micro SD card reaches full capacity? You will get notification if storage is almost full. Once the micro SD card reaches full capacity, new videos will start rewriting, deleting over the oldest videos. Can I use a new micro SD card if I do not want to record over existing videos? Yes, you can use a new micro SD card if you do not want to record over existing videos by removing the side cover on the camera and replacing the exiting micro SD card with a new one as long as it does not exceed 128 GB. Once this is completed, you will need to format the micro SD card by going to the SD card settings in the settings menu and pressing format SD card then confirm. Warning, reformatting micro SD card will delete all content stored on card. Important, this device complies with part 15 of the FCC rules. Operation is subject to the following two conditions. This device may not cause harmful interference and this device must accept any interference received including interference that may cause undesired operation. This equipment has been tested and found to comply with the limits for Class B digital device. 
Pursuant to Part 15 of the FCC rules, these limits are designed to provide reasonable protection against harmful interference in a residential installation. This equipment generates, uses, and can radiate radio frequency energy and, if not installed and used in accordance with the instructions, may cause harmful interference to radio communications. However, there is no guarantee that interference will not occur in a particular installation. If this equipment does cause harmful interference to radio or television reception, which can be determined by turning the equipment off and on, the user is encouraged to try to correct the interference by one or more of the following measures. Reorient or relocate the receiving antenna. Increase the separation between the equipment and receiver. Connect the equipment into an outlet on a circuit different from that to which the receiver is connected. Consult the dealer or an experienced radio slash TV technician for help. Warning, changes or modifications to this unit not expressly approved by the part responsible for compliance could void the user's authority to operate the equipment. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.